Good morning, everybody. I apologize. We have some explicit content today because in the golf world, this word is a curse word. The shank. It's somehow contagious. We hear that word and all of a sudden the ball starts going everywhere. For those of you that might not know the shank and maybe you've experienced this before is when the golf ball rather than hitting the face of the club catches the hosel and it's going to come off sideways and it's a very unpredictable shot. So what causes the shank? Well, more often than not, we're moving closer to the ball or what we call early extension. So in this video, I want to show you how you can test to see what might be causing your early extension and then give you some solutions to how to fix that. So go ahead and swipe over to the next video and learn, learn how to diagnose and then resolve this issue. All right, so let's say we're getting ready to hit a shot. We set up with the ball right in the middle of the face. We make a swing and boom, the ball goes sideways. What happened is somewhere in the swing, your body and the club started moving towards the ball, exposed the hosel, and now we have a shank. Well, it's probably caused by tight calves and heel cord causing you to lunge forward. So a great, great way to test this is I want you to get into your golf posture against a wall, put your feet together, and then can you squat all the way down to the ground with your feet flat without lunging forward? If you do come up onto your toes, then yes, this is tight and we need to resolve that. So let's swipe over to the next video and learn how to do just that. All right, so there are a few different ways that we can resolve this issue, but this week is all about our mobility ball. So that's what we'll talk about now, and we'll have different techniques in future videos. So let's have a seat, grab your mobility ball, and we're going to place it right above your, uh, your heel, underneath the ankle and the heel cord. Now what we're going to do is, if you can apply extra pressure, go for it. If not, don't worry about it. We can add that later. But we're going to move around side to side, forward and backward, and then move the foot working everywhere from just above the heel all the way up the calf to the base of the knee. And we're going to play around. It's going to take you a few minutes per side. And we're going to break up those gunky spots and re-lengthen that whole system of the calves and the heel cord. Now you're going to be much less likely to lunge forward when you retest against the wall. So I definitely want to see your guys' progress. Let me know if this helped your shanks. And then tune in tomorrow as we continue to talk all things golf mobility. Move better, play better.